Hi there everybody, I'm Carl from Prestige Auctions. I just want to talk to you a little bit about an item that's come into this week's auction uh, that needs a little bit more than just the normal uh, catalogue photo, etc. So uh, it's a beautiful uh, ladies Amiga watch. Uh, so we're just going to show you it as it has come to us in the box. So this lovely ladies Amiga watch has come to us uh, from an estate clearance in Grimsby. And uh, what's really nice about some of these pieces that got put away and uh, worn for best, shall we say. So people would have these watches years ago and uh, because they were such good quality and so nice, they would just keep them locked away, maybe only come out on special occasions. But when this happens, of course, things like the box, as you can see there, they're in extremely good condition. And, you know, that's all important. So a collector of these older watches, they want to see all the original bits and bobs there and in fantastic condition. So you lift this lovely, you know, as you can see there, the Amiga sign on the top there. You can lift this away and as you can see inside the box, there's no splits or cracks or anything. Now, if you are watching this video, uh, this uh, this watch will actually be in the auction on June the 22nd, Saturday, this coming Saturday, viewing on Friday the 21st of June. Uh, 2024, if you are watching this video in the future and you just wanted to have a look at this lovely Amiga watch, well, as you can see straight away, the bottom box is in extremely good condition. The bottom section, let's just move that around like that, as you can see, well, even all the tape sides are really nice. And we're gonna lift this out and of course what you see straight away is the lovely brightness of the red uh, in the box itself. Now of course these boxes like have like a spring mechanism uh, on the back there. So you can see there it's a really nice uh, side. The, the logo looks really good. And the, the uh, golden colored gilding uh, is also very good as well all the way around the box. As are the hinges, no rusting or anything. Uh, just a little bit of scuffing at the back there, as you can see. Just probably been caused when it's been moved around in the box, etc. So there you go. So that's the, the box. Well, of course, let's just lift this up. And there you go. It reveals this absolutely stunning uh, ladies Amiga 9 karat gold throughout um, watch. Now, these sort of smaller cocktail watches were quite big uh, back in the day. And uh, I believe this one was bought, I'm just gonna check. This was bought in 1981. So there you go, 1981, which, you know, he's, he's, he's 40, 43 years ago. So, you know, this has been kept in extremely good condition. Now, these full nine karat gold straps and the nine karat gold casings are probably some of the better ones that they did. And uh, as you can see down there, if I can see on the inside, you can see look, all the there's not a whole lot of wear to this you know as all old watches it would probably benefit from a clean but uh, the strap itself is in pretty good condition as you can see throughout all very nice indeed um there you go i'm just going to try and zoom in there there you go so ladies amiga nine carat let's just uh, have a look at the edging on the button there you go as everything as it should be as well and then underneath there. Now, I'm just going to put the camera down for a second. I will carry on talking to you just for a second. And uh, just while I pull uh, something on the strap, because I'm doing this a bit one-handed at the moment. Now, is, here we go. That's the piece I wanted to show you. So they're just on the inside of the strap. There you can see the 375 Hallmark. So you can see that the strap is nine karat gold, as, lo as well as the whole of the, the casing of the watch. That's all in nine karat. Look at the back of the strap as well in really, really nice condition. So if you're looking for something, you know, to treat yourself to, or maybe to treat the lady in your life to, why not a vintage watch? Because you're not going to get... Um, you're not going to get much for your money these days in you know decent watches uh, that are brand new so this one here as you can see look everything is in such good condition uh, i can tell you that the total weight of this including the uh, mechanism of course is around 38 grams i think it said there yeah total weight 38 grams so you've got a lot of nine carat gold in there um this has got a bit of a reserve uh, that anybody that comes down to the auction we are more than happy to tell you but uh, there's the all-important paperwork as well uh, a lot of people that come in and are looking to buy sort of the more luxury end watches do ask us about this you know because it is important international guarantee there the amiga stamp 
and then uh, it's a bit telling you about there as well. I'm just going to hide the details on there, but there you go. There's the model number at the back, and uh, and of course the uh, the numbers, all important numbers at the side. Okay, so that there, have you got all the information in there that you're going to need uh, uh, to help authenticate this fantastic old watch. Now, these things can make a few quid. The reason being is because one. It's an Amiga, it's a very nice watch, it's in a very nice case, and it's in extremely good condition. But what also helps these along is the fact that, you know, I'm not quite sure what the weight of the movement is in one of these, but there's a lot of 9 karat gold. When you consider that the full value of 9 karat gold is somewhere around £21 something a gram at the moment for full value, if you can get that anywhere, you'd be lucky. Um, so you may be looking, you know, at probably... I don't know, don't hold me to this, but I'm going to estimate sort of six and a half, seven hundred quids worth of, of gold. I'm, I'm not entirely sure on that one without taking it to pieces, which is something we're not going to do. But this has got the value as an item as well. So this lovely watch uh, will be going under the hammer uh, on Saturday. It's lot number 273, as you can see there. So that'll be probably... Uh, getting on for an hour and a half into the auction which starts at 9 30. so look at this watch one more time what a beauty this is nine karat gold condition is excellent i would say for its age 43 years old and still in this condition well i think if you're looking for a little treat maybe for yourself and of course don't forget, also, it's not just a treat when you're buying something like this. It's actually an investment. So if you end up paying, I don't know, seven, eight hundred quid for this, you know, the price of that gold is always going to be there. So it's really important. I'm just going to show you one quick other item uh, that came in with it as well. And this beauty here, look at this. Nine karat gold cameo brooch. This is a big one. Uh, it's extremely good condition. Once again, look at all that carving work that's been done into that cameo shell. Absolutely stunning with a nine karat gold border. I don't know because I can't take it to bits, but I would estimate there's probably six or seven grams in gold in that. And you can see there that the hallmarks on the side of that one as well. So overall, these both came from the, the same estate. Look at the look at the foxing on that old box as well. Really nice. So uh, this these both came from the same property. Two very nice items in this Saturday's auction. Well worth coming down this Friday to Prestige Auctions and having a look round of at the other 1,100 or so lots that's going to be in this week's auction and uh, and maybe treat yourself to something a little bit special. There is, of course, a lot of other jewellery in this week's sale. If you want to look at the catalogue, please go to our Facebook page. Uh, that catalogue will be live on the Tuesday before the auction, Tuesday evening, and, uh, of course, uh, you can always go to our YouTube channel to find out more information on different things that we stick videos up about. Uh, viewing is Friday, 8 in the morning till 7 at night on the 21st. Auction starts on the 22nd of June uh, 2024 at 9.30am. I estimate this will be going under the hammer about 12 o'clock. Thanks ever so, much, ever so much for watching. Please hit that subscribe button and we'll keep you up to date with all other things that are going on at Prestige Auctions in Grimsby. Thank you.